Hi, in this part 2 videos of analog to digital conversion in the MCU, I will use the MCC or code configurator to generate code uh, for reading the ACC of the microcontrollers. So if you want to have the MCC installed in your uh, MPLAB X, you have to go to plugin and then uh, Okay, see available plugins here and look for the MCC. All right, so uh, my plugin here already downloaded the MCC or the MBLAF code configurators here. Okay, we close the current projects and we create new projects. All right, then we can start the MCC here. It takes some time to start up. All right, we save the current ACC. So MCC is the uh, guide or the user interface for faster generated code for you. Uh, I have here the pin manager. This is the one I don't like it. Uh, instead, I want another package or the SSO. All right. So I want this. Uh, I see. Okay. Then in the system modules, I select the internal oscillator, internal one, but the frequency one megahex. Okay. Then I open the tab register to turn off the Brownar reset, fail safe, and uh, the other function I don't want to use, I will turn it off. Okay. That's it. Then I press the generate button. Okay, it will generate for me the code that I set here. Okay, I go to the projects. Now it will generate the main files. Let's take a look at the main file. Okay, turn it off. All right, so it generated the file for me, the main and the system initialized. In the system initialize has the pin managers, oscillator, and what docs. Okay, that's it. And it has all the files I need in the headers. Okay, and in C5, device configuration, for example, I set internal oscillator. That's good. Okay, for the MCC. D5 configurators, okay, and the pin managers. All right, the twist. Open here, I will see another define for the frequency. Okay, we go next. So the input module, the pin modules. Okay, for example, the pins here. I want to have the uh, port C. Is the output so I set it here output output okay and I turn off the analog functions of the port C okay right here then I add one more functions these are the resources of the current MCU the 16F1509 so I have here two type of uh, the libraries I can double click here or here. All right. So I might want to use this. Okay. After double click, I have here the libraries open for me. So here is the setting for the clock, ADC clocks. For example, I take it here. The conversion time should be 736 something here. Okay. The result. Okay. 
the reference is the VGD or the external uh, just click on the screen okay whether I use interrupts or not all right then uh, about the channels I have here another ADCs okay then I want to select uh, ADC 0 or ADC 1 okay and then I lock it all right it should appears here okay so it's appear one more channel a and zeros okay and channel a and y and the others function if i want to set is the a d con zeros okay disable or enables okay go down or something then if i finish configuration here i can generate it will make another C file and header files for me, H file. Okay, I have here the ADC headers. Okay, in here I have all the function I need to use the ADC modules inside the microcontrollers. So it is the settings, is the initialize. Okay, remember that it will generate another line here initialize okay we go back to the adc then the select channels here's the descriptions for how to use it with example start conversion okay return something here and the function all right then is conversion done all right start so we can copy a sample code here and put in our code all right take it copy and then we go to the man for uh, the wireless here and then we put it here so they declare a two byte variable the converted value all right and then ADC initialize I have it here already so I don't need it uh, the initialize anymore and then start conversion now the ADC here for my ADC is channel and dash AN0. So I might want to change to channel and AN0, okay, for my channels. That's it. Then I put it uh, in the Y loops to make it works, okay, repeatedly okay here's the weight and take the result okay we can uh, get the result uh, and export to the large as before uh, i put here the large all right i go back to the pin managers here for trees b okay Let's say Tris B. Where is it? All right. I want to make it uh, output here and output here. Okay, system modules. A pin managers device. The input system pins here are uh, A or B. Okay, it's here already output and then regenerate it okay and go back to main files okay where i have here the lot c equal to the convert value for the uh, first 8 bit all right and then um, the convert value has to be n with 0 b and then 1 All right, the night bit one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. All right. Then I take the conditional commands here. Last b bit dot b six. All right. Else, sorry. Equal one. All right. And then uh, 
this one to zero if it's fail it's not true okay and another bit for last b7 and last b7 okay so i translate my code okay now the same function is before but the code here is generated by the mcc then we upload it okay oops no oh, we got a new one is the adc mcc and week seven okay all right okay we got it here the same right we have the same here we will use the old functions uh, or I might turn it off now we will use the old functions to displace the number in the seven segment LEDs here okay uh, I add the uh, libraries I created before uh, let's go back to the C review here okay in uh, review okay this is my function the LED function I take the copy and also with the header files okay then I can have it in my programs here okay only one functions so I take it to my programs let's say uh, include all right and then LED function okay and in the LED function is say display then I can use it the display oh check it I want to put it here delete and display the converted values all right but the first digit or the unit we take uh, the modulus for 10 for the first digit and then uh, I take uh, divide by 10 and take it the modulus another one by 10 to take the tens of the unit and then uh, so on 100 and take the modulus to 10 to take the 100 okay here 10 okay here is unit all right and then uh, last one for the thousands so we divide by the thousands okay do not need it all right and then in the LED function we have to generate one large pulse okay zero and then uh, one okay let's check if we miss something all right we got it here then we upload to the code mlab x which seven okay and mcc demos production okay there we go all right one zero two three okay we change it okay let's say in the middles all right 50 2.5 and the value is one one five one one five hundred and eleven okay that's it so we got the ACC MCC working okay thank you and see you next video